New numbers show the flu has already claimed the lives of 21 people across the Carolinas this season, 10 in North Carolina and 11 in South Carolina. NBC Charlotte's Kendall Moore shows us how doctors and pharmacists are bracing for the peak. Kendall. Yeah, well, it's time to get the tissues and the Tamiflu ready. Doctors say that the flu has not peaked yet here in the Carolinas, but they are preparing for the worst. <laughs> the coughing and sneezing is coming. We're inching into flu season. North and South Carolina report increases in flu activity heading into late December. We haven't hit the peak of flu season by any means. Last flu season, the virus peaked in North Carolina the week of February 9th. The year before that, the week of February 23rd. It's leaving doctors guessing when the virus will peak and how many it will affect this year. So we don't know yet how the flu season's going to play out. We don't know yet how effective the vaccine will have been. Doctors and pharmacists both still say the vaccine is the best protection. You can get vaccinated, it's going to prevent other folks from getting sick. And if you happen to get the flu, it's going to be far less severe if you didn't uh, get the vaccine. After last flu season hit the Carolinas hard, Walker's Drug Store is stocked up on the flu vaccine for prevention and Tamiflu for when the virus strikes. After the busy travel season, the holidays, that's typically when you see a lot more cases of the flu. So we're gearing up and we're in stock and prepared to provide any uh, immunizations or, or flu products come January 1st. A virus doctors and pharmacists are bracing for in the new year. Get vaccinated early, get vaccinated now. It's never too late to get the flu shot. As the heart of flu season inches closer in the Carolinas. Now, pharmacists say that it takes about two weeks for that flu shot to become effective. They recommend getting a shot that will work to prevent multiple strains of the virus. Reporting live in West Charlotte, Kendall Morris, NBC Charlotte.